Welcome to Brando Consulting. This is Lance, and in this video, we're going to look at three different ways to create transfer orders. First of all, let's find the screen. The transfer order is under Materials, Transfer Order. So, to manually create a transfer order, we simply come up here and click New, just like you would with a sales order. There's a From location, that's the building we're shipping it from and there's a to location, the building we're shipping it to. Uh, we're going to request that Los Angeles ship it to us. I'm in the Salt Lake City area, so I'll be the, excuse me, I'll be the owner of Salt Lake City. So the checkbox here goes at the building that you work in, okay? so. There's a couple different types of transfer orders that you can select from this point. There's a ship type transfer order and a move type transfer order. A ship type transfer order gives you the ability to not only pick from one location to another, but pack and ship so you can have a, a packing list. Uh, we'll look at that in this demonstration. Okay, and then let's request from LA some bicycles. Since we're on the Bicycles Unlimited database, we'll select uh, 50 or 40 hybrid bikes, and let's select um, 25 comfort bikes, and we need, uh, let's say, 25 mountain bikes. Okay. So we're almost done with our request. Under the Details tab, we'll request when we would like to receive it by. We need it by the 22nd or the 24th. Let's give them a little bit of time. And it's just asking us to update the dates for each line. And we'll say, no, we're not going to pick it up. That's what we'll call means. We're going to ask them to deliver it to us. And then the very last step, click issue all right so click new decide where it's coming from where it's going to the type of tran the type of uh, transfer order and then add the lines okay so the next type of transfer order we want to look at is replenish love this feature replenish is an automatic way of creating a transfer order and what this means is one of your warehouse is getting low and you're going to have Fishbowl determine what is low in your warehouse. It looks at the quantity on hand in that warehouse. It looks at the quantity demanded under that warehouse. It looks at what you're already waiting for to come, you know, like an out, outstanding purchase order or other transfer orders. It looks at outstanding manufacturer orders. And it also looks at your reorder points, your min and max levels. So when we click next here, we'll say, okay, let's uh, ask LA to replenish us here in Salt Lake City. It automatically went to Salt Lake City when I checked that box. And then it tells us that it's going to include parts without reorder points as well. In other words, if it, they're on back order, it'll trigger it. And it's going to ignore parts that are supposed to be manufactured. Fishbowl's smart enough to do that and it's going to ignore parts that are custom manufactured. It's smart enough to do that. Click finish, it churns, it thinks, it triggers, and then like magic, there's our transfer order with all the parts. Last step, we click issue. Now this feature, I also like uh, the put away feature. So I'm going to click on put away. The put away feature uh, works like this. Your guys will receive the inventory and just leave it on the receiving bay. Leave it in the receiving bay. They haven't yet put it away. Um, it may have to go through some quality check or something. And, and uh, this will recognize everything that's in the location that you select. Nine times out of ten, we're going to select receiving. And then we'll want to put it away in the same building. Of course, Fishbowl gives you an option to put it in a different building. Just select the building you're in. We're, 
putting it away from receiving to everything else. Owner, that, that doesn't matter in this case. And then we click finish. So then Fishbowl searches and finds everything that's in the receiving location and puts it on this transfer order ready to put away. Last step, click issue. And the next video, I'll show you how to fulfill these transfer orders. Pick, pack, ship them, and receive them. Thanks for joining us at Brando Consulting. I'll see you in the next video.